Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on finding the median of listed data. Now the median is a type of average and it just means the middle value. And it makes sense we might use the middle value as the average. For example, if we wanted uh, an average salary of people in England, what we might do is order everyone in ascending order of salary and just pick the middle person because the middle person would be the average Joe, the average person. And the advantage of the median is that it's not affected by extreme values because if you took your average Joe, you look to the middle person, he's not going to be affected by someone earning a super high salary because we're only looking at that middle person's value. Now if you want to find the median of this data here, this one's relatively easy because the data is already in ascending order. And it's quite easy to see what the middle value is. We could count inwards. So if we start from the two ends, count inwards, 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 and we can see that eight is the middle value and therefore the median is eight. Now B is a bit harder. Firstly, because the data is not in ascending order. So the first step here would be to make sure that the data is in ascending order. So zero is the smallest value, then three is the next biggest, then seven is the next biggest, and then 11 is the next biggest. So if we were to do the same as before, we were to count inwards to try and get to the middle value, the two ends, count inwards, and ah, there is no middle value. So what do we do? Well, in the case where we have an even number of items and there isn't a middle value, we just use halfway between the middle two. Now, what's halfway between three and seven? Now, if we were to visualize it on a number line, we can see that halfway between three and seven is going to be five. But to find halfway between two numbers, you could just add them up and divide by two. So three plus seven divided by two is indeed five and that is the median of these numbers. Now for the last one, this is just a trick that we can use if we have an odd number of numbers. And to work out the position of the middle one, you first count how many there are. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So there's eleven items. And to find the position of the middle one without having to count inwards, what you can do is you can add one to it and then divide it by two. So if we add one to it and divide by two, we want the sixth item. 11 plus one over two is six. And what is the sixth item? One, two, three, four, five, six. It's 10 centimeters. So the median is equal to 10 centimeters. And if you don't like that trick, then you don't need to use it. You can just count inward from the end. Da, 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 da and we get to the 10 centimetres. But this method is useful if we have a large number of items and we don't want to have to try and count towards the middle.